With predictable problems steering his domestic agenda through Congress, the area where the Lula government in Brazil has most been able to make its early mark is foreign policy. That was highlighted on Tuesday with a summit meeting organised by Lula, South American heads of state converging on Brasilia to discuss regional integration. Under Brazil's previous regime of Jair Bolsonaro, they frequently snarled at left-leaning neighbours. Lula said that everyone had lost while ideological differences had interrupted a process of integration that he sees as a permanent objective and an absolute necessity. He outlined a series of suggestions along with the idea that a working group spend the next few months coming up with concrete proposals. The most eye-catching, a common currency for trade purposes, reducing obviously the importance of the dollar. Also on the list, EU-style educational mobility, along with greater cooperation on issues such as health, energy, the environment, defence and infrastructure. But a stone in Lula's path is attitudes towards Venezuela. On Monday, Lula met with Venezuela's president, Nicolas Maduro. Afterwards, he said that the United States sanctions were to blame for problems in the country and that a false narrative had been constructed presenting Venezuela as authoritarian. On Tuesday, Lula's views on this subject were criticised from the right by Uruguay's president, Lacage Pou, and from the left by Chile's Gabriel Boric. Lula intends to kick-start South American integration. It's a significant development, but on the issue of Venezuela, there's no easy consensus.